welcome Anthony Hudson with you. We're ready for Thursday night football. Wonderful weather for football. Looks like the fans have opted for the lounge chair for this encounter. I'm paired in the box here today with Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. Thanks, I know I'm very excited about tonight's match. This evening's match is between Collingwood and Carlton. They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. We know the scoring capabilities of both teams, so it's all about the defence of both sides. If this turns into a shootout, it becomes about which team holds up better defensively. They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. Captains converge for the toss of the coin. Carlton winning the toss. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. What an exciting matchup we have here today. A big game about to get underway. Thump clear. Fighting hard was Bell Chambers. Castagna missed an opportunity to mark. Pomps lobs the handball. Here's Redden. Rushes with the kick. Cunnington leaps over the top. A low stabbing kick. Brayshaw runs after this one. Kerno shows some physicality. Has a man running for him. Through for a nice ball. Plowman with the kick in duties. Doing well with the mark. Kicks it out of the back 50. Intercepts the ball well. The kick from Dunkley. Schofield wins the ball in the air. Puts boot to ball. A solid mark from Crouch. Heads long with that kick. The contest, no match for him. Yes, I know. Red moves it now. Gets a touch to the ball. The ball is turned over. Harbrow can send it back. It's cut off by Moore. Gets it out in time. Jones has resources out wide. Lloyd plays on. Dunkley grabbed it clean. Hurried kick. Kerno doesn't take the mark. Finds a way to go along the ground. His teammates rush over. The first goal of the match. Back in the middle now. Wins the right duel. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Schofield gets in the way. He gets his hands on the footy. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Just dismisses his opponent. Intercepted by Wood. Bruce puts his body on the line. Going for goal number one. A drop punt through the goals. Half of love kicking that one. Collingwood get themselves on the board. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. He did really well there and gets the reward. Back with another set of bounce. Taps it down. Is in his possession. Harbrow spills it. Bell Chambers gets it out of congestion. Does well to cut off the kick. 
Looks up with a kick. Mark Boshi. Got boot to ball. Bell Chambers gains possession. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Works it across the ground. Fife runs after the ball. Dunkley earns a free kick. Chose to kick it. Holmes there to mop up. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. He drives it. Great mark in the pack. Puts it on the boot. A good mark out of the circumstances. Uses it now. Dishes it off. Five getting in on the act. Going for goal number one. The drop part sails between the big sticks. They get around him after that effort. Seven points the difference. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Umpire ready to resume play. One down by Cruiser. Five controlled the difficult ball. Hands it out to open space. The handball hits the target. Kerno goes for territory. Plowman presents and takes the mark. Works the ball out of the 50. Gets into some space to mark this. Sinks the slipper into it. Holmes got under it. Punches the kick. And he stepped over the boundary line. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Carlton aren't making the most of their hit-outs. It's going straight for the opposition. He drives it towards goal. The Blues by eight points. Ready to bring it back into play. Gets into a good position to take that. Braun puts it on the boot. Marked by Glauman. Glauman tucks it into the pocket. Marking in space was Rouch. The ball in the hands of Hobbs. Pierce wins it back. Wants to keep it moving. Castagna gives it off. And now they go. Congratulated by his teammates. That's two in a row for Carlton. The lead is now 14. That's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. Centre bounce. Guides it down. The bounce made it tough. Vardy slams it onto the boot. Taking a nice grab. 40 metres from home. Moving on. Garner going for number one. The drop puck goes straight between the big sticks. He accelerates hard after that. Collingwood, no need to worry yet. Back in the middle. Vardy just slaps it down. He gains possession. Vardy just threw it. Mitchell collects the kick. Dunkley looks to get onto the football. Free going the way of Schofield. Decides to kick. Great grab. Holmes goes with the kick, takes it well. Carlton are playing a very controlling game. They're taking plenty of marks and denying the opposition possession. Alex to kick. Ablett found some space and marked. Now with a low spearing kick. Terrific mark there. 
Hunter drives the kick. Marks now and can send it back. Goes with the kick. Plowman did well to win that ball. Plowman has resources out wide. Redden takes it well. There's the siren for the end of the quarter. The scores the Blues 20 to Collingwood 12. Carlton should be pleased with how they've started. If they can build on that quarter, they'll be hard to stop. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? Collingwood could winning the clearances, but they haven't been effective and they haven't turned them into scoring opportunities. Thanks, Gaz. Ready to go for the second turn. About to resume play. Cruiser thumps it clear. Five complies the tackle. Great tackle. Cunnington hooks the kick. The margin is nine, considering the options on the kick-in. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Doesn't take the mark. Finding the ball was Jones. He's got the footy in his hands. With the ball now. That looked great. What a goal. He's enjoying that goal. Carlton by 15 points. Back in the middle to resume play. Clears the contest. Taken by Crouch. Wood pushes his opponent off with one hand. Francis does well to mark. Uses it by foot. The ball mopped up. Collects the loose ball. Puts on a big hit. It's a free kick for Collingwood. Slams it on the boot. The ball finds Redden. Looks to move it by foot. The ball ends up with Fantasia. Keeps the kick low. The mark is taken by Broad. Moves it by foot. An easy grab for Cross. Doing well to intercept that kick. With a driving kick. Nice hands. Chips it towards half forward. A chance to reload the attack now. Decides to go to the middle. A mark by Rayshaw. Rayshaw has resources out wide. Castagna leading the race to the loose ball. Gets it away. He wins possession. That's a really poor finish there. Have to find a way to do that. The Blues lead is now 16. A strong mark in the pack from Frost. Frost tucks it into the pocket. Hobbs uses the body well. Moves the ball by foot. Open opportunity for Redding. Goes by foot. Easily takes the mark. Moved on by Frost. Frost, a better man there. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Can't be the dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Now they lead by 17. Plowman looking to bring it back into play. Puts it on the boot. Fife determined to reach the ball. That's something to smile about. Cunnington making the lead bigger. Celebrating hard. Carlton with a handy break. They lead Collingwood 35 to 12. Barty thrashes it. With the ball is Redden. Fends off the tackler. Redden has resources out wide. Thomas doesn't want to let his teammates down with this kick. Nobody can hold on here. Cleverly suckers it off the ground for a goal. Harper puts his second on the board. Gets some reward for his efforts. Collingwood reduced the margin. We're back in motion. Winning it was Fardy. Brace your soccer's at forward. 
picks up the loose ball. Cunnington has a teammate on the move. Stuck the bits out there and held on to it. 20 metres out. He slams it towards goal. He's excited about that one. Carlton beginning to apply their supremacy on the scoreboard with a lead of 41 to 18. Punches are clear. Showing control was Hunter. Dunkley brings it out of the pack. Got hands to it. Scoops it up. Just gets the kick away. Puts on a bomb. Francis charges with intent. Just goes bang. Releases the handball. Brayshaw picks up the loose ball. Scoops up the ball. Decides to keep it alive. That one rounds up the post. Carlton stretched the lead to four goals. Players move as they look to provide an option. Dug it out. Gets around Mr. Invisible. Nice. Schofield uses it by foot. Marks in a bit of space. Tavenar kicks it. Cameron grabs that one. Elected to play on. Got boot to ball. Good mark and looks to send it back. Kick by Wood. Geary dug it out. He has the ball. Keeps it moving. Has it now. Applying the physical pressure. Finds the loose ball. Had plenty of the ball. Spears the ball. Well picked up. Hands that ball to the opposition. Kerno quickly onto the boot. And the mark will be paid. Chips it towards half forward. Collected by Francis. Needs a bit of a rest. Drives it out of defensive 50. The mark is taken by Mitchell. 50 metres out. Going for goal number one. Unfortunately, lets them down there. Carlton, go over Collingwood by 25. Carlton have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should try and slow it down and control the ball for a moment. Schofield drives a low kick, finds a target. Broad elects to kick. She is the body to take that. That's it for the first half. What can you tell us, Gas? A good first half from Carlton. They can be well pleased with how the game is shaping. What do you make of it all, Gaz? Carlton are gaining a lot of their advantage through some smart kicks and even better marking inside their forward 50. Much appreciated, Gaz. Both sides taking a much-needed rest at the long break. The second half just moments away.
The third quarter about to get underway. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. A chance for Cruiser. Brayshaw couldn't complete the tackle. Intercepted. Geary throws the ball away. Chips it towards half forward. Collingwood would love to make the most of this opportunity. This will have to be his very best kick to score from this far. Hunter launches towards goal. What a fantastic goal. Look at him, he really enjoyed that one. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Swanson, five now. Links with hands. Hits the target by hand. Quick hands, and they could be away here. Sees the opportunity, and was able to take it. That's his first. Bruce enjoying that goal. The Magpies could kick back-to-back -back goals. Can they capitalise on the momentum? That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Carlton got behind in the clearances, but has set up well enough defensively that it hasn't made a big impact. The game is back underway. Carlton have failed to get on top of the clearance, but it's how they can turn the ball over that is allowing them to score. Fife wants to keep it moving by hand. Hits the post, and it's a behind. And they continue to miss these opportunities. The lead is now 14. Plowman looking for options now. Plays onto himself. Elects to kick. She gets on the end of this. Uses it now. Frost takes the mark uncontested. Gets a quick kick away. They can create from this. Dunkley goes it alone. Into the post of goals. They are really struggling in front of goal. Now they lead by 15. Weighing up the options now. Plowman plays it to himself. Uses it by foot. Good body work to win the mark. Jones a long way out. The kick will be from a 45 degree angle. A great mark taken there. She drives the kick. Stands tall and marks. Carlton just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Frost leads all comers on the ground. He is dominating this game. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Piers applies a bump. Oh, have it. Hammers it. Uses the hands instead of the body, and it's a free kick. She goes with the kick. Chera takes the mark. Slams it on the boot. He takes the mark. Goes the long option. Good mark there. A spearing kick. Schofield has it. Slick with the hands. Finds his man. Bruce links up with a chance to run. Vardy finds his man on the move. Prouch might have overworked himself there. It looks like the ball will be coming back. Puts boot to ball. Takes a strong mark. Wood kicks it. Just threw the ball. Kick by Brayshaw. Winning the ball in the air was Mitchell. Carlton have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Wood with an easy mark. He drives it. Takes a simple grab. A chance to put one through for his side. 45 metres out. Cameron going for number one. They'll be ruining that opportunity. The scoreboard starting to worry Collingwood now. 
Brayshaw has a great set of hands. Uses it across half back. Thomas gathers it now. Looking to kick goal number two. Pretty happy with that one. The Magpies have kicked the last three goals. Just under two goals the difference now. Punched away. She has the ball. The ball spills. Ends up with Garner. Cruiser dug out the loose ball. He flicks it over. Harper finds possession. Sloan puts another one through. That will settle the nerves. Gets his first on the ball. Look at them celebrate that effort. Collingwood close the gap to two. That's a really good team, though. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. About to resume hostilities. Cruiser with a big fist on it. Kerno with a short hand pass. He spears the ball. A chance to reload the attack now. Looks up with the kick. Finds this and marks well. Did well to get a hand in. Francis with an opportunity from the turnover. Pierce gets the loose ball. Turned it over. Plowman. Hurry kick. She marks quickly onto the boot. Goes off the ground. Sloan rushes with the kick. Thomas looking to track down the footy. He couldn't hang on. Gathered by Fantasia. They'll snatch the lead if this goes through. Doing well to intercept that kick. Chose to kick it. Mitchell takes a strong mark. Sinks the slipper into it. Jones marks it. Got the hands free. Finding the loose ball with Geary. Kicks hurriedly. The ball spells the ball. Slams it onto the boot. Great mark. With a driving kick. Takes the mark all by himself. Offs the play on. Just puts it out in front. He just throws that ball. Goes with the kick. Bell James takes a strong mark. Moves the ball by foot. Pierce runs after the ball. Finding the ball with ease. Drop punt. Finds the play home for Castagna. Another goal. He's kicked a couple now. Smop. As we go to the final change, the scores are Carlton 51, Collingwood 43. A big final term coming up. Carlton will want to keep the foot on the accelerator and finish this last quarter strong. What do the stats tell us, Gaz? Collingwood can't have any trouble winning the ball. They just need to use it more effectively to get into a winning position. Thank you very much, Gaz.
Let's see what this last quarter throws up. They need to get a move on if they're going to win from here. We resume hostilities. Cruiser got a fist to it. Practicing some fancy moves. The tackle deserved a free and gets it. Didn't get away from the tackle. Fantastic pressure there. Dunkley wins the foot race. And the umpire calls for a stoppage. Lots of pressure out there at the minute. He's really making an impact in this game, Gaz. He's really having a big impact on this game. Francis collects the loose ball. Sloan won himself a free. This is kickable by his standards. Normally a good shot on goal. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. We'll have another ball up. Cruiser won the hit out. Fantasia collects it. Kerno having a big game. He has been outstanding here, Hutto. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. If they just maintain position and hold onto the ball for a moment, they should be able to hold on here. Bruce hung out the loose ball. Fantasia is streaming past and gets the footy. Seen plenty of it. The loose ball picked up. Kick goes astray, and it's out on the full. Goal scoring opportunity for Tabernard. 35 metres out. A goal from this spot is unlikely, but it is possible. Of course, Hunter. Going for goal number one. Unbelievable effort, and it ends with a goal. He acknowledges the crowd. Collingwood now only trailed by two. Back with another set of bounce. Big thump for Vardy. Got the hands free. Jones steals possession. Movement by hand. Doing well was Morrison. Does well to keep it in play. Unfortunately not for long as the ball goes out. Toss back into play. Vardy thumped it clear. Sweeping handball from Schofield. He's got the football now. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Looks to move it by foot. Nice work from Hunter. Elects to kick it long. Thomas will be upset with that. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. He's gone missing lately. Jones onto the ball. Stabs at the kick. Castagna with the mark. Keeps it moving. Just kicks it long. A good job. Keeping it in play there. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. It's a very tight game right now. Umpire tosses it in. Thrashes it. Castagna gathers it now. Feigns a handball. What a kick. And he puts it through. He just loved that one. Carlton, but eight. About to resume play. Barty clears the contest. Ball up in the centre square. Thumps it clear. Goes off the ground. Didn't get away from that tackle. Outstanding pressure. Redden goes by hand. He's put that one through. He's excited about that one. Probably only one roll of the dice left. We resume hostilities. Thumps it clear. Takes possession. Cruiser is blowing hard after that effort. The ball goes to ground. She wins the foot race. Interesting handball. Brayshaw cuts it off. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Cruiser hurls it away. Just put it on the boot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Decides to kick. Good mark by Carpet. Moves it by foot. They chase after the loose ball. And the umpire will ball it up. 
clears the contest. Showed good control. Runs straight into a defender. Great attack on the ball carrier. Francis didn't mark it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Crouch loves that goal. They've taken the lead. Back in the middle now as the rucks go at it. Bell Chambers gets onto the ball. Doesn't hold onto the mark. The kick from Brayshaw. The mark has been taken. 45 metres out. Lloyd goes for it now. Summed it up and he delivers perfectly. He acknowledges the crowd. The Blues go back in the lead again. The umpire's set to bounce to restart the game. Proud gets on the end of that handball. There'll be a ball up on the centre square. It's very tense at the moment. Punched away. Ablett couldn't stick the tackle. Cunnington was taken high in the tackle. Goes by foot. It'll be a ball up. Vardy thumps it forward. Moore collected the ball well. Tabernacle with quick hands has a runner alongside him. <laughs> Thomas sets his sights on the goals. 45 metres out. They'll regain the lead if he nails this one. Incredible game. They can't be long now. Looking for options now. Plays on from the kick in. Almost cut it off. It bounces to the advantage of the opposition. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. This is a big kick in the context of this game. A kick to hit the front. Drew decides to go to himself. Goes with the kick. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Fantastic tackle. The free kick going to Brayshaw. Got boot to ball. You really want to come away with the four points when you're this close. They'll have to settle for two. The final result again today was a draw. The teams ended all tied up on 63. That's all for today. On behalf of myself and Gary Lyon, thanks for joining us. We'll see you again soon. It's been a pleasure, Hutto, and we'll catch you next time.